And then yes, what the, the issue that li that Newcastle have is that they don't control games. They yeah. don't have a way to play outside of running and attacking and being nuts. They kept seeming to give the ball away and give Liverpool chances. Uh, the the error by Guimaraes to for the final goal is yeah, just like but you cannot. My guy, do what that. are you doing? That's what I'm saying. You what are you doing? Do, you cannot be mentally away from the game. Basically, I would say this in. What happened was to, to 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 Liverpool in the beginning, they weren't in the game. And at the end for Newcastle, they left the game way too early. And yes. unfortunately, the end of the game is what matters the most. Because at the end of the day, I would have been like, hey, let's go home with a with a point. I mean, it would be it would be it it would be you know, it would hurt, but this was devastating. Liverpool have killers. Salah is a killer. Exactly. A that's killer. the that's that's the difference, and that's the difference because Klopp is a killer. Yeah, he's always he's like gritting his teeth. He's yelling. He's I got the Klopp teeth. I need to get shy to it. I can't even do it because his yeah. teeth are so crooked. His whole jaw is crooked. He's a killer. He wants to win more than he wants to breathe. Exactly. I don't know if Nunez is, but I know Salah is, and Salah played the ball into him. That's it. Salah wants to score all the goals, right? And a lot of the and Allison is a killer and Van Dyke is a killer. These guys have won the Champions League together. Robertson is a killer. He'll run all day and never fight to the death. I don't know if if Trent's a killer, but he's yeah. been a part of this team. But these other guys are killers, right? And it's well, part of the club and it's in the club. And this is the six time European champions. This is Liverpool. This is no joke. Don't mess with us. Don't no, give that, us a chance to win this game. We're gonna come and win it. That's a that that is, that is a fact. When you have when you play against these teams against Manchester City, Liverpool, teams that have done it, you cannot be lax days ago. And that's City what happens is with developing it. I think it's relatively new. City no, is no. developing it. It's not a given. You have to do it. But uh, now, well, let, let's listen to what Eddie Howe had to say about about the game. And that's uh, as painful as limp. the game at Anfield last year for for me and for us. I thought we played really well today. Um, Fuck off! You know, the, I don't want to hear that. The opening <laughs> stages of the game can't be forgotten by by me. Um, in regards yes, to the team's performance and reflection on how the game went, I thought we were excellent. Individual performances were very strong, and I just, you know, the sending off almost harms us really in the match. Um, although the chances were there for us to kill the game, as you say, and I think the second goal changes changes everything. We didn't get it, and you know, then when Nunes comes on, it's it's they're looking for one moment, and they didn't just get one; they got two, and and they took them. Yeah, I mean, I'd, I'd want them to be hurting after that because. We pride ourselves on trying to trying to win first and foremost, and if we can't, then you know we, we do everything we can to, to draw the game. And that's uh, well. I mean, I, 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 listen, you can't say that after you lose that way. It, it's all wonderful. You gotta, you gotta, you and, blast your team. And and, and, and that's and, and that's why I now question and, and kind of what we talked whether about. Whether he's a killer. And what, what we talked about earlier in the season, the week, first week, whether whether he, Newcastle went this far last year. Probably ahead of time, and but now to take them over the to to take them to the mountaintop is is it going to be Eddie Howe? Because I, and a lot of people I, I've been watching talk sport and a lot of people that know him you know talk good about Eddie Howe and everything else and I, that's perfect. But it, looking at it cold cold blooded, just analyzing the situation these past few games where you know you have to bring everything in your being. To get get these games against Manchester City against Liverpool, and you really you start you change you you did well with Liverpool in the beginning, but it, all that goes away after you basically you know leave the game mentally. It you know yeah. it's ninety yeah, minutes. I, I, I think it's I think it's uh, it's it's an open question, and we're gonna have to find out. Everything so far, I think, is okay. They've lost two games. Blah blah blah. City is fine. This is fine. You know what? You know who has a killer on their bench? Even though they're a small team, and you you guys are gonna laugh at me, Deserby's a killer, <laughs> and they're gonna go to Brighton next, and that's not gonna be an easy game either, right? You yeah, could argue yeah. it might be. I mean, listen, we know what we're gonna probably get to Brighton at least a little bit. They lost to West Ham. They got outmuscled, fairly or unfairly, but that's gonna be a tough, tough game to go all the way to to the Amex and try and be, play that really free flowing attacking. Uh, 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 Brighton side who are coming off a loss that they don't like yeah. either. And right? they're going to have to get in. two teams that... B BJ right there saying also any top coach would 
put their team on blast. And that's the bottom line. You can see Ange Pasta Koglu would kill. <laughs> it would be nobody left in the damn locker room. <laughs> it would be, we have to sign everybody. The youth has to play the next uh, match because everybody's gone. <laughs> For top football news, debate, analysis, and opinion, join Top Football Club. Watch live on YouTube or on the Top FC News website or listen live on the AMP app and on your smart speaker, Top Football Club.